Hi, today we're looking at one of the questions that was recently posted to us by one of our clients. So, for this client, what they are asking is, how can they prevent some of their team members from changing the unit price but they still want to see it during the entry screen? Alright, so before we can set up anything, we first will need to set up in the maintain store item. We have to make sure that a price has been set there. So to do this, we come to stock, maintain store item. Let's say Ericsson battery. So we press edit. Here we can see what's the reference price here. So we we'll make sure we have a price here. Alright, so $150. All good. We just press save. Okay, so let's say we want to set the setting in my sales quotation. So let's go to sales, documents, click sales quotation here. Right? So let's say we just double click onto one of our quotations. So here you can see this is our detail headers. We just need to right click anywhere around here. Right click. You can see there's a feature called properties. Click properties. Right? So let's say now we would like to change and make sure that the unit price doesn't change so what happened is we come here unit price you can see this unit price here you can see there's an editing function so we just uncheck here just press ok all right so of course once we press that all users will then be locked from editing the price however we would need to set it by a user level so to actually set this layout to a user level first of all we need to save this layout so we just right click here grid layout save layout all right so let's put it as not the default layout but here we can put here oh, price to be yeah we'll save it all right so let's say we want to set this user up here you can come to grid layout here we can have manage layout so let's say we want to set a certain user that cannot amend the price so let's say we want to set as tax so we can say this is their default layout so once done we just press save and then we close this then we close this all right so now let's see what's the impact like we close this screen we log back in on change the user to text so let's say today quotation press sales quotation let's press a new quotation let's select customer let's select an item so let's say we will select it's now is battery Ericsson battery right the price 150 see right now I cannot click the price Alright, so all this I can change, but I cannot change the unit price. So you can see that the function is working properly. Alright, so that's done. We just press save. Alright, so actually you can implement this lock feature in your other modules such as sales order, such as invoice, such as credit note as well. So it depends on where you want to lock the pricing for your particular team members. Alright. So we hope that you find it useful. Do like and subscribe to be notified when we release any new guides. Thank you.